All right, if you've been following our Houston Habitat for Humanity build, you know volunteers and sponsors have been busy this week and the work is still underway out on the northeast side of Houston. Lauren Kelly live now at the build site. Lauren, good morning. We understand you have some special guests with you today. I do. Of course, we have to bring back Allison Hay, the executive director of Habitat for Humanity Houston. Now, people were asking me, do you guys really need a construction hat and the glasses? Because yes, we do. It's an active construction site, as they can see behind us. That's right. That, so right now, what, whatever we're around, we think safety first. And so we ask that you put your hard hat on. And today, safety glasses because of the wind. And the sawdust is in the air. But I also want to show our viewers the absolute amazing <laughs> progress that they have yeah. made in just a day and a half. Look at this. There was just frames yesterday yes. and concrete yes. and now the walls are going up. So the, the whole process of uh, sealing the envelope when you hear that you're actually going to see what we're doing, which was we put the frame up, but now we're putting the sheathing on. Then we'll put some uh, protective for the environmental kind of water sealant and then you'll put the trestles up tomorrow. So it's a it is a great thing to see how your home is built. I love that because a lot of our viewers, if they have a home being built or if they've had a, a family member's home being built, they don't know the process. So to actually watch the process from the ground up is pretty cool. It is. And you know what? Our home uh, people in our home uh, family partners, they learn this from the ground up as well. So when they're learning about their family and their home and their financial literacy, they're learning how homes are built. So when they repair it, they repair it themselves. Now, Allison, let's talk a little bit about the Habitat build and how other families around Houston can get involved. Maybe they've seen us on TV the last couple of days and they want to bring their family into this as well. How can they do that? So we would uh, we have all the information on our website www.houstonhabitat.org. We have information sessions in Spanish and in English every month. Just sign up for one and we will be able to attend. But if you have a burning question, just send us an email. There's a link there and we'll answer your questions. Well, I know that we said this home is supposed to be finished by June, but the speed that they're moving at gives me something else to think about. I feel like it's going to be done before then. Well, you know, the volunteers we have are awesome, but there are other uh, mechanicals and there's a lot of things behind the scenes. So while it looks like we're going fast now, we also want to plan for weather and for any other stoppage because these are home buyers that are planning their lives and their budgets around home ownership. So we don't want to overcommit and underdevelop. So Absolutely. we want to over. That's right. Exactly what she just said. That's what I we said. had a great surprise with the homeowner yesterday. She's still out here building her home. Yeah. So we'll check at, uh, back in with her a little bit later on. Allison, thank you for all the fun today. It's we just appreciate. getting started started out here with our KPRC2 10th annual build with Habitat for Humanity Houston. Back to you guys. You are right about the speed of things, Lauren. Behind you, it's a totally different scene than what we saw 24 hours ago. It's amazing what they do. Our thanks to everybody out there, including yes. 